What's up everybody, it's Coach JB with Hoop Study. Welcome back for another film study. Last week we broke down this Horns playbook. This week we're diving deeper into UVA's playbook. And remember, the play calls are by their actions. They're not their actual play calls. They're taught in progressive reads, just like a quarterback. And the first read is always to score. Now, don't forget, if you want to grab these playbooks, they are inside of our Coaches Academy. Just head over to HoopStudy.com, and that's where you can sign up. Now, in this video, we're going to focus on the Loop series, but you can see the rest of the playbook, and we're going to start with Loop Dive. Now, it's called this because of this loop action you see from the guards, starting from the wing, coming through the post players. And once they get through here, they're going to hit the guard out on the wing and set this cross screen for their post player. So if you have a post player who can isolate and score, this is a great play for him. Let's check it out again live. Good job with the tenacity of sticking with the play. Virginia 0 for its last four from the floor. Next, we have loop elbow. I really like this option because it clears out the help defender. You're going to see again, it's initiated with this loop action by the guards. And afterwards, they're going to throw the ball directly into the elbow. And they clear out the help defender by cutting the weak side big through the paint. And then she drives right off of her backside or her hip. You'll see it again in this clip. Again, the guards loop. And then they throw it right into the elbow. And they clear out the help defender so she can drive in right behind. Let's check out a couple more clips live. 69-52. Sorry to pick up at Wake, and then of course Coach Mox is well aware of being from the state of Virginia, how proud this trick. Next we have Loop Gate. Now I love how this leads to a triangle scoring option, and we're not going to see any clips of them getting to the gate, but that's okay. We'll still break it down and show it to you. So each time they still loop, and then they get over into this triangle formation which I love because they're able to feed the post and let them go to work. So if you have a good post player, this is a good play for you to run for them. But again, they're gonna go through that loop action and afterwards they're diving their weak side big down to the scoring area. And this sets them up for a great passing angle to throw it into the post. And afterwards, as you can see, they have that gate or elevator screen action up top if it's there as well. This team where they need to get to. Cameron Taylor backing down and then the turnaround. Now for loop stagger, I'm going to show you a couple of options that I drew up that are not in the video clips. So for the first one, it's a cut option. So after the point guard dribbles off to the side, they can come off of a stagger. The second option is a dribble handoff. So for this, the two guard is still coming off a stagger, but they're going to receive a dribble handoff instead of a pass. Checking out the film, you're going to see why I really like this play. Because of all the action, the defenders don't have their eyes on the ball. And this really frees up the ball handler to get into a scoring option. And if the ball handler actually gets cut off when they're going through this action, they still have the ability to find their post player coming off of that stagger screen. Let's check out these two clips live again, so this way you get a better feel for it. Makes them compete for the spot. And Diamond Johnson was the sixth woman of the year in the ACC last season. Kitley, last season, the preseason, uh, the player of the year in the conference last year, this year, the preseason player of the year. And the numbers are very similar, even after averaging more rebounds a game this year. Now, don't forget, if you want this playbook with all the video breakdowns and the diagrams, all you have to do is sign up for our Coaches Academy. It has all of our playbooks and all of the smallest nuances of the games broken down for you. All you have to do is go to hoopstudy.com and click on the Get Started button. We'll see you inside.